A little while ago, some footage pretty much surfaced, you know, of uh, Freddie Gibbs allegedly being beat down in Buffalo after, you know, talking, you know, going back and forth with Benny the Butcher and Griselda. Well, today on Instagram, Benny the Butcher had enough and he actually, he actually showed the chain that supposedly was snatched from Freddie Gibbs' neck in Buffalo. Now, I'm going to do it like I, you know, I'm going to play. The video of Benny, him showing the chain, and then I'll give you guys just a little bit of the backstory. Roll tape. Hey, yo, MC Dinosaur Barbecue. That's what got your head punched in the first time. Talk about shit you ain't had nothing to do with. Real shit. Niggas dragged you by your chain. Dragged you by your shit. Niggas took this off your bitch neck. You put MC Dinosaur Barbecue. You been getting ran down on by niggas for the past year. Without a gun. You a big MC Dinosaur Barbecue. Niggas punched your head all in, had you fucking lumped up, stitches all in your shit. For running your mouth like you doing now. Remember that? Then you went next day and bought that cheap ass Cartier watch. <laughs> Just cleaning my jewelry up today. Nothing exciting. Just cleaning my jewelry. Alright, so here's a little bit of the backstory. You know, Benny the Butcher said something. This was probably back like in March. And then Freddie Gibbs actually left this video. <laughs> Niggas said like, working with Freddie Gibbs came and went. Man, I, I know some other shit that came and went too, nigga. For real, just keep my name out your mouth, man. When y'all talking to people who are doing interviews and shit, just say next question, man. I don't want to talk about that, nigga, man. Just so I guess at some point they were supposed to get it in and work together. Maybe it never materialized. I'm not really sure about that, but what I do know is that on Twitter, on Twitter, that um, you know, Benny first put he put I never seen ends tough nowhere but the internet as, as a result to that video. And then like two days later, right, Freddie Gibbs put this tweet out and said, shout out to my Houston ends. Now, at that point, things had reached a boiling point. And this is when Freddie Gibbs goes to Buffalo, right? He goes to Buffalo, you know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, he goes to a restaurant to eat and he supposedly gets accosted, beat up pretty bad, according to Benny the Butcher. And they snatch, you know, his chain, allegedly. That Benny, you know what I mean, show right there. So let me know what you guys think about this, man. I think it's a little wild or whatever, but you know, nevertheless, man, it, it, this is what happens. You know, you 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 go back and forth with somebody, then you go into their city. You know, you're pretty much going into the Lions then at that point, especially a spot like Buffalo. I think it's a spot I've been up there. You know what I mean, right next to Niagara Falls, and they get it in, in Buffalo. And sh shout out to Buffalo. You know, as well, the Upstate All-Stars TV that always showed us love up there. All Buffalo artists, you know, Shay Noor, you know, uh, we ain't got a chance to get Benny in here yet, but we had Armani Caesar, you know what I mean? Buffalo always, always showed love to the platform, so I got to salute Buffalo. But, yeah, you go to anybody's hometown, you're pretty much subjected to whatever they want to do. That's why you got to watch what you're saying. Freddie Gibbs was never going to just run his mouth about buffalo's golden child right or the best thing that probably ever came out of buffalo and going to a restaurant and not be touched it just wasn't going to happen so let me know what you guys think in the comment section man crazy crazy occurrence benny the butcher allegedly got the chain was snatched off his neck let me know what you guys think hit the like button share the video and this video is brought to you by hiphopun.com that's hiphop the letter un.com for all your latest hip-hop news peace